everything in between. It's a big crush Tuesday, and we're here for our morning scriptures from our misters. Oh, Christchurch was off its head. They were, um, they certainly heard them the last sort of 20 minutes. Um, and it's massive for us, bro. It's like, you feel it, it's an energy. Um, yeah, so to, to know that they're going to sort of show up and, you know, do their part, um, yeah, it makes us, keeps us accountable, you know, to make sure that we're at the very least giving it everything we got to do else. So I'm um, excited to obviously get back to Mount Smart this weekend. Um, Any time we play there, but it's always, you know, something we don't take for granted and to know that it's going to be, you know, sold out, um, that's, yeah, that's actually, that's really exciting. So, um, yeah, looking forward to that one, bro. I said I'm so high, put me on This year we number one, pass a beer, cheers Never thought we'd be up in here Christ, Jersey City, so pretty in the summertime We drop a summer rhyme and it got to be double time So high, lazy guy, down for whatever Uh-uh, ain't no one better than the 19th Letter, letter, as to the sizzy Y'all is he busy, man Can rap to get dizzy, can't get busy the way I can I'm well known to expand on ya I'll leave you touch without even laying a hand on ya Y'all know the whole ho, ho, don't be coming through Good. I feel like it's once we just got to get our first win, and I feel like we hopefully can um, get sort of that out of the way now and can move on and hopefully get a few more. I've no idea. I'd have seen those flying locks drifting across the field and thought I may as well just hit a hole when he, the winger can pass. So I just thought I'd hit it and he that was a beautiful ball and yeah, lucky. What about? Oh, it's ridiculous. How like obviously I'm I'm not from New Zealand, but to come down here in the South Island and it was packed in the preseason game, and I thought that was another level, but this was just. Ridiculous how um, the crowd turned up and yeah, I think we've got another three years down here and I, I can't wait to come back. Yeah, look, I think at this point we were just yeah, stoked to come down here and get the two points, bro. It was, um, it's always going to be a really tough game. You know, they've started the season really well and, bro, man, we don't make it easy on ourselves, eh? But um, yeah, much better feeling to be able to leave, leave this place with two points. Get back home, bro. Get to do it at home. was it next Sunday? So um, we'll get home, reset, um, do what we do every week, you know, review it, recover, and go again. Like it wasn't a bad performance, um, but I just thought what we did in the first two rounds, um, we probably warranted a little more than, you know, obviously not getting the two points, but that's just the way it happens sometimes. So um, to be able to find a different way to win, um, you know, the Raiders, they're in a pretty good spot at the moment. They're playing some really good footy, so it was... Uh, it was always going to be a challenge for us, and we we just found a way. We ultimately found a way within our within our systems as well, which is um, yeah, which is probably the most pleasing part. And all my friends, too many to name, but you know who you are. Most importantly, I know who you are. Cheer. Yeah, obviously, footy's footy, but I think um, you know, like Sachi, she's seven, eight months old now, and uh, starting to move a little bit, so. Um, just seeing yeah, her growth, her personality starting to come out and then obviously we know what Miller's like so it's um, life outside of the club is um, it's really cool and um, yeah in a really good place. Uh, so we are here shooting a bit of a, a, a pre-season uh, launch for the uh, 2024 season for the Almighty Warriors baby. 
So just, just, just so happy to be a part of it. Like I said, I'm a super fan, been a fan since day dot. So it's just awesome to be a part of this, you know. We are the Warriors, a hundred percent. Something in the works, man. So um, you know, definitely look out for that. Uh, been working on it for a little bit with the club as well. So yeah, I'm looking forward to releasing this one. Bro, 2024 season prediction as always. Always got the faith, bro. We're going all the way, baby. We can that down, baby. You let's go, boys. We are the Warriors, the hundred percent. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> It's an honor and a privilege for me to represent with you guys. I'll be praying over you guys this season. All the best, much love. Like just sort of scratch my face said um like but yeah, there was there were patches throughout last year which uh quickly forgotten about, you know, in this res resurgence talk. Um but I'm not keen to have those patches, so I'm still pretty hungry. Like, I, I feel like I've got a point to prove I haven't really achieved anything, you know, so, um, and that's how we feel as a squad. You know, we got so close to tasting the ultimate goal last year, and when you know you've got a squad and you're, what you're capable of as a side, and you've got that confidence, um, it's really up to us with how, how it plays out now. Um, so, that belief, that trust is there, that, you know, the coaches are going to put us in the best chance to succeed. Um, so it's completely up to us as a team, us as an individual with how we apply that, you know, every week and um, not get bored of that. So that's where I'm at with it, you know, on a personal level as well. They got some really good players, bro. So um, they throw a lot at you. We're going to have to be on our toes. Um, we're going to have to be, you know, really disciplined and staying switched on for 80 minutes. It's one of those weeks where if you switch off just for a second, they'll find you. So. Um, lots of threats, but also, you know, excited to see what we can do with the footy. You know, we've got a few threats ourselves, so it's going to be a good game, really good contest, really good challenge. These are the games you want to play. Who knows what the next couple of years are going to look like, but I mean the hunger part, um, I think that comes from um, purely just wanting to win. You know, that competitive bug in me is still very much there and wanting to achieve something pretty special at the clubs at the top of my list, man. So I, you know, until that happens, I think you'll see, well I hope that, you know, you'll see that in my game. Um, and then, you know, I've, I've found that when I have that, you know, when I've got that competitive edge that the rest of my game can sort of flow off the back of it. You know, the detail, the execution, um, that all happens off the back of that intent and just wanting to win and wanting to compete on on every play. So uh, I'm loving that at the moment. I'm really enjoying sort of being in the contest and, um, you know, outcome aside, just just doing my part to, you know, ha help us get a win. And um, that's all it really comes down to. Show you the one home. Can I get your name?